little bit is making a bee line for all the dandelions as we go up towards the paddock and letting her and her lamb out. And dandelions are the best food for a lactating cat, lactating cat. I just had a cat jump on my shoulder. I kid you not. That was time jumping on my shoulder or on my back as I'm talking about dandelions. So they're so highly nutritious. Look, she is eating into the dandelion and eating as much of it as she can because it is the best, most nutritious thing for a lactating herbivore. Look at her, that you couldn't have a bigger mouthful of dandelions. And this, we have decided to look at muck savage already. Little bits, lambs always have um, loads of uh, dirt on them. And again, he's a dirty boy, look at that. She does that every time. So we, I've, but I've decided on a name. He was born under a larch tree or in the vicinity of a larch tree out in the field. Look at that. That's all dandelions she's munching on. The leaves. There is a flower. She's munching the flower and digging down in to grab the herb itself. So the most nutritious herb for lactating animals are dandelions. Look at her, she's eating all the dandelions. Isn't that right? Isn't that right? And she's eating grass. She's having a balanced diet of grass and dandelions. And there's some clover there too. But the real thing she's eating are the dandelions. Munching the leaves. See, those are all dandelion leaves she's eating. Okay, come on. We've got to move up towards the paddock. I know, you want to keep eating. I'm going to pick you up. Ooh, there we go. And we're going to go up here past loads of dandelions. You going to eat some dandelions? There we go. Yes. I've got your baby. So things like dandelions prevent milk fever if the lactating animals get the dandelions. Look at these. Oh, this tree smells so good. Nope, go that way, go that way. Go on, you go in. There we go.